Not in the Act on Fox 10 is sponsored by Hunter Security. Your security is our business. Get this, a very bold thief hits up the Pritchard Waterworks and sewer plant near Chickasabogue Park, not once, but twice. The first time happening on June 5th, the second on Saturday, June 15th. Here's Lee Peck with Caught in the Act. Breaking and entering, it's the second time he's returning this month. The suspect, with a big drink in hand and smoking a cigarette, makes himself right at home at the Pritchard Waterworks and sewer plant near Chickasabogue Park. Unlike the first time, it's the middle of the day on Saturday, around 2.40. He's browsing through all the tools, taking a tape measure, then trying on some goggles for size. He'd load up on a lot more tools, stuffing them in his pockets, then dropping one. Bending over to pick it up, he gave the camera an unwanted eye fool, nearly losing his pants. He'd then take a wheelbarrow full of gas tanks and extension cords before returning. You'll notice he's lost the shirt and appears to have taken a dip in one of the water pools outside. While he was there for more than an hour and a half, much of his time was spent trying to figure out how to get this garage door open to take off on that lawnmower. Once out, he'd even close the door. But he wouldn't get far. In an attempt to get away, he drove that lawnmower here, believe it or not, before going off this embankment. A pretty good drop off. Going a ways before getting stuck just beyond this point, then taking off on foot. In addition to what he took this time, we're told during the first visit, he stole a small John Deere utility vehicle. Here's a better look at him. Notice he has a tattoo on his left arm. If you know who he is, turn him in to Pritchard Police. With tonight's Caught in the Act, Lee Peck, Fox 10 News.